Hey guys welcome back to my channel so in today's video i'm going to teach you on how to make patatim so a lot of my friends in bulgaria said that they always watch my channel and i share some of the food from bulgaria but they are curious about filipino food so yeah i decided to make this recipe the main ingredients is going to be the pork leg guys this is called pata in the philippines we also have here pineapple chunks. This pineapple was a fresh pineapple which I put in the freezer a couple of days ago. Black peppers and some bay leaves. Ginger, onion and garlic. Banana ketchup which is very common in the Philippines. Oyster sauce. Filipino soy sauce. Salt, sugar, oil and the broth that I used last night for boiling the pork leg. So, let's start cooking. So, let's start our cooking by putting a little bit of oil. Okay, now we can put the ginger. The onion. And then the garlic. So after like 3 minutes guys, you can now add your soy sauce. I think you can put like 2 or 3 tablespoon. On this recipe guys, I just I just use my guts. <laughs> I don't use measuring spoon, something like that. So yeah, to make your life easier on cooking guys, on this recipe, all you need to do is just combine all the ingredients together. After mixing all the ingredients guys just add the broth from the from the boiled leg that you used from when you boiled the legs yeah anyway guys I put while boiling the pork last night I put pepper salt and bay leaves and boiled it for like two hours depends on how you can use pressure cooker it's more better so add salt and then add a little bit of sugar also So to make your sauce thick guys, just grab a little bit of cornstarch and mix it together with a bit of water and pour it on your mixture. So I think our sauce is ready, we can now put our pork leg. So guys, just follow what I'm doing because I'm having a hard time to speak English. So what I'm doing right now is what you can do also if you want to try this recipe.
So now guys, if you think that your pork is already coated with the sauce that you made, you can now put the last ingredients which is the pineapple chunks. So boil it for like 3 minutes and you're good to go. After 10 years guys, our patatim is ready. So if you have a clarification questions about this recipe, don't hesitate to put a comment below and I will going to try my best to answer your question. Patatim is a very common food in the Philippines, especially on fiesta, birthday, something like that. So yeah, thank you so much for watching guys. Again, this is your friend Filipina Yordanova. Have a wonderful day in your neighborhood. God bless your beautiful soul everybody. Ciao!